our customers are telling us that they need to sample their data paths with a wider range and a finer resolution. Many of our customers have SOCs that are going onto multiple platforms. On top of this, many of them have one SOC that they're taping out into multiple technologies. They all need a consistent and easy way to close timing for these SOCs. One of the biggest challenges is the SD design where they need to have a driver that can support both 1.8 and 3.3 volt stick only. Putting all the pieces together for SD and EMMC is another big challenge. Did they, do they have all the connections correct? Uh, is their ESD robust enough? Do they need to worry about power sequencing? Did they optimally place the delay lines with the IOs? Will these IOs support all of our power down modes? These are all questions that our customers are coming to us and having problems with by putting individual pieces together. We have built a file that addresses all of our customers' needs. We have high-speed IOs and DLL delay lines to make sure that we have alignment between the host and the memory device. We also have ESD and power sniffers inside of our FI. Our customers do not need to worry about any sort of reliability. Whether it comes to power sequencing, we allow for any sort of power sequencing. Uh, leakage, we have low power modes. Removal of certain power supplies. Our power sniffers take care that we are in a power down state when any of the power supplies are there so that any SOC power state we can handle. Our FI is area optimized for both SD and EMMC. One of the biggest features of our FIs, though, is that we're fully interoperable with the Synopsys controller. It is fully verified with the controller, it was built to work with the controller, and customers will have no issues integrating both of these together and will be a complete solution for either their SD or EMMC needs. For more information, you can contact me at synopsys.com. Thank you.